The invasions of Russia and Ukraine, which became increasingly heated, made President Vladimir Putin even more vigilant and launched a number of Panzer S-1 air defense systems on several roofs of buildings in downtown Moscow. This information appeared to the public after a local resident's account uploaded a picture on social media. In the picture it is clear that the Russian government is increasing defense by installing mobile anti-aircraft systems on several roofs of a building, including the central government building in the city of Moscow which is located about 2 kilometers from the east of the Kremlin, the Ministry of Defense building which is located along the Moscow River Road, as well as the Ministry of Education which is about 10 kilometers from President Vladimir Putin's residence in Novo Ogiriovo. Not only that, a number of parties also saw an air defense system deliberately installed towering near the Luzhny Ostrov Forest Park, precisely on the northern border of Moscow, as quoted by Al Jazeera. The central government in the Kremlin has so far refused to provide an explanation regarding the reasons for installing the air system, but a number of parties consider that this installation was carried out as a Russian strategy in securing a number of important locations from the threat of Ukrainian missiles. They are responsible for ensuring the security of the country in general and the capital in particular. Therefore more defense systems are installed, said Dmitry Peskov, Russia's press secretary. Especially when the invasion began, the territory of the Russian government received several air attacks from unmanned drones. Even in the attack that took place on December 5, three people were declared dead at a military airfield about 600 kilometers, 370 miles, from the Ukrainian border. Although Ukraine has repeatedly denied these accusations, Moscow believes that Ukrainian forces are behind the drone attacks on military infrastructure in the country. By launching the Panzer S-1 system, this air defense is claimed to be able to track the movements of aircraft, helicopters, and cruise missiles and drones both at short to medium ranges. Apart from tracking the Panzer S-1 system, it can also make perfect shots. Russia is known to have installed two types of Panzer S-1. The first contains bullet ammunition with a launch distance of 200 to 4,000 meters at an object altitude of up to 3,000 meters. While the second type is armed with missiles where this tool can carry out attacks with a range of 1,200 to 20,000 meters at target altitudes between 15 to 15,000 meters. By utilizing this weapon, the Russian government believes it can provide more protection to a number of important areas.